beautifully rendered. Of course. These are but basic principles of planetology. So you're saying that Mako is spiritual energy, which we're using up? Just so. Siphoned from the planet and processed for industry, that energy can no longer fulfill its true purpose. It is fated to fuel man's machinery, then fade away. Okay, but does it actually fade away? I mean, what if it doesn't? What if it just returns to the life stream in a different form? Is that possible? A novel theory, suggestive of a lack of understanding. Hmm. However, that can be overcome with time and education. Your sleeves are a little too long. <laughs> Please escort this young lady to our seminar room, would you? Right this way. Okay. Hey, can I come? Got a question. The planet runs out of energy. It and everything on it dies, right? <sighs> yes. Is there any way to avoid this? Like, making the spiritual energy stronger? Why are you asking me such things? <coughs> Damn. <sighs> I'm sorry. I've come to realize that I'm somewhat stuck in the past. We've entered an era in which humanity exerts unprecedented influence over its environs. And as both the planet and society evolve, so too must science. And yet it seems that I cannot. Perhaps I'm much too old of a dog to learn any new tricks. How old are you? Was my explanation of planetology not to your liking? Perhaps a seminar would provide a more agreeable experience. Was my explanation of planetology not to your liking? Perhaps a seminar would provide a more agreeable experience. I don't know, that was pretty fucking cool. <laughs> I don't think some class is gonna be cooler than going into that. <laughs> Guess we're going back down. Huh? A warm welcome to you. Friends of Nanaki. How the devil do we Thanks even get so to that? Thanks so much for taking such great care of Nanaki for us. Fellow Bugenhagen instructed me to let you take anything you think might prove useful on your journey. Check out the storeroom when you have a chance. Okay. Thanks, bro. Is the little one Nanaki? Red, is that you? Or some unrelated family? Moogle medals? Five thousand gil. These photos, they're killing me, man. Who's the other one?
Okay, that's everything it looks like. Thank you, Come friend. If we've anything uh, uh. to fear, it is not our fellow man, nor any creature big or small. Blessings of the planet upon you. Still can't go in this one? Right this way. Oh, never mind. We can go in this one. Is this uh leading us to where everybody else is at? Observatory tre okay, more treasury stuff. Just more loot. Sweet. Okay, I think purple means gear. Ooh, is that our first X potion? I think it might be. Crystal Megaphone. Okay, we're getting all sorts of stuff for you, dude. Moogle Magic. Maybe we'll master this one first. We'll see. Use an equip summons ability. Can only use while riding Moogle during battles in which summons are available. Ooh, that one's gonna be hard to master then. Cooldown increases with each use. So, summons are only available in boss fights, right? So I won't be able to do Moogle Magic or master it unless we're in a boss fight. Is that right? No, it, I think he, I think summons are possible in other fights. Do they have to have a charged meter? We'll find out. We'll find out. Okay, Moogle takes less damage. Increases luck while riding. Yeah, we'll do the Sentinel, why not? We'll give you an HP up. Okay, so Red and Kate need to master some abilities. Yep, that's the full family again. Oh, these were connected. I just missed this. All right, cool. of the planet upon you. Nothing else over here, right? Nope. Okay. End of the path. Alright, so there was that place where they offer the seminars. I'm guessing that's where I need to go down here. Let's go see if that's true. Hey, there's Yuffie. Put your faith. This village is lame. Did you know none of the <laughs> materia here is even real? And don't get me started on the planetologists. It's a bunch of blowhards in love with the sound of their own voice. Wait a minute. They have a materia shop. If I bought materia from them, is it actually fake? <laughs> and offered up prayers of gratitude. No man, woman, or child would suffer. I heard from fellow Bugenhagen. By all means, please come and join the seminar. Follow me if you would. Which would you say is a more worthy pursuit? They are both one and the same. Wouldn't you agree? I ask you this. Who among you has looked as the planet? Oh. 
A seminar is in progress. I've uh, always been on the bigger side, but I've never been into physical stuff. Painting and poetry are more my thing. My old man, he he used to say it was a waste, me spending. What about you, miss? You must have a story to share. Please. Me? Uh, okay. I, uh, where to begin? I fell into the life stream. I don't have words to describe it, except beautiful, maybe? It was a lot to take in. Feelings of kindness washed over me. Long forgotten memories came flooding back. It was a warm, comforting place. But there was also conflict. A war between the planet and its enemies. And I can't, I mean, we can't let them win. We need the planet and it needs us. We have to rise up, fight back, defend it from this terrible threat. Thing is, I don't know how to do any of that. And I hoped you might have the answer. <sighs> I'm not criticizing planetology or anything, and I'm not trying to scare anybody either. I just... You know... <sighs> Never mind. This is all coming out wrong. Please, do not be discouraged. Should you ever wish to try again, we would be more than happy to listen. What matters is that you keep challenging your beliefs. Stop doing that, and the answers will forever elude you. On that note, I think we should adjourn for the evening. The River of Lights is almost upon us, so let us head to the torch. See you at the festival. Hmm. I don't know, man. Tifa doesn't seem to be doing okay. She's having a rough time of it. I mean, she clearly cares about Cloud, and after, like, what he did to her... She's been very forgiving, but, like, I, I feel like there has to be a little bit of a rift there still. The River of Light ceremony will begin. This night comes but once a year, bringing us closer to the planet. I've no doubt you'll feel her grace. There is no seminar being held here at the moment. Okay, River of Lights. All the time I've spent here, listen. It's so great learning about planetology with everyone. We are siblings all. We yearn to chase the horizon. There's Barrett again. Look at them, gathered around the fire. Just like us that day. Me, and Mom, and Dad. If only we could do that again. Uh, never mind. 
Just forget I said anything. I'll lend an ear. Whenever I think about my mom, my chest swells with so much pride, I... I feel like it'll burst. No. Oh. But when it comes to my dad, I just... Sorry, I can't. Still not ready. That's all right, buddy. Sorry, I can't. Still not ready. I had the pleasure of talking to a mentor. Said it was presumptuous of me to think I could save the planet. She decides her own fate, you see. As rain cleanses the skies, so too does she cleanse herself of filth. So what? We sit here and theorize while the planet rinses and repeats? We fight was probably the best answer. Not nothing. That's for damn sure. But at the same time, though, I don't know if fighting's the answer anymore. Maybe it's time for some good old-fashioned introspection. That's a statement coming from the guy who uses the gun on his arm to solve most of his problems. Planetology, Avalanche, Marlene, and me. I don't know. Did I sound as awkward as I felt? You did good. Can't help it if they suck at listening. I got what you were saying. <laughs> I kinda wanted everyone to get it though. <laughs> to hell with everyone. <laughs> Great advice. Thanks. Kiss, 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 kiss. <laughs> I'm still laughing thinking about that moment. It was Look so at good. Those stars. Some carry a fire that rivals even this. Like the you. She would never forsake us. Never abandon us. When you die, you return to the planet? That has literally got to be the dumbest thing I have ever heard. Once you die, that's that. Why do you think that? I just do. I believe in anything else until I see some actual proof. All right. How much longer are That's they going to totally be doing fair, this? honestly. I feel like I live my life that way. It's like I, I tend to be rather skeptical until I have solid proof, you know? As somebody who grew up religious and left it as soon as I was able. I very much am more about reason than faith. <laughs> The thing is, is that we do have proof in this world, <laughs> in the Final Fantasy world. We have some actual tangible things to latch on to. So there is a fundamental difference. Oh, I didn't see if Kate was around, but he doesn't have relationship stuff, does he? He would have shown up with an icon, right? So, I'm an ancient, as in a steward of the planet, one of those ancients. Or, to be more precise, the only ancient. For the most part, it's been a source of pain. I've been held against my will. I've been watched. I've been ignored. Even hated. And it's been that way ever since I was little. My blood's been nothing but a curse. If I ever started to forget, something would remind me of what I was and bring me crashing back down to Earth. It was always the same. Time after time, I'd be shown a glimmer of hope, only to have it snatched away. Oh. I was never gonna be normal. That much was clear. You have to, you ha like, I never played Crisis Course, so I don't know the full story, but you have to imagine that Zack was one of those things. And then when he had to leave again or whatever, however that might have happened. You have to imagine that was a real blow for her. One of her glimmers of hope.
Girls had it rough. It's okay. <laughs> God, I live for that smile right now. Jesus. So my blood's been a curse, but it's also been a blessing. It's brought some wonderful people into my life, friends that I love. And for once, I think I'm okay. Happy even. And all that pain feels worth it. Even if I can't lead a normal life, there is one thing I can do. Return their kindness. And try to make the most of what I've been given. So yeah, it is a paper lantern thing. Sappy, huh? She's bubbly on the outside, but you can tell she's just so sad. Every word, though. It's heartbreaking. It's honestly very impressive that she can, like, appear so happy all the time considering all the shit she's gone through in life. Real testament to her so, ability to this is where you've been, survive. <laughs> What's up? There's something of great import I need to show you. And by that, I mean all of you. Join me, would you? What did you all think of the River of Light? For whatever reason, the ceremony has drawn a number of tourists to the Vale as of late. When I ask for their impressions, they often speak of how beautiful it was. Some claim they were even moved to tears. It's an overwhelmingly positive reception, I'm happy to say. To stir the human soul is no small feat. And it pleases me to know to that Aaron. the River of Light possesses such power. Alas, my hopes to parlay their emotional response into a deeper intellectual curiosity. They have yet to be fulfilled. People are surrounded by cats, dogs, birds, and trees. They know that life is all around them. Be it through the birth of a baby or the blooming of a flower, they bear constant witness to the blessed cycle of creation. Yet they've no interest in the welfare of our planet. Oh, man. Oh, oh, oh. Forgive me for sharing my idle thoughts. Keeping them to myself is quite a challenge in my old age. How the message that this game was conveying when the original came out and it's still relevant. In the worst way. <laughs> still relevant in the worst way. Still nobody cares. Just as a whole, society doesn't seem to care all that much. Today's experience. 
experience was surely the will of the planet. May you cherish it always. We proceed. Uh, but I thought this door was sealed so that none may enter. Why, yes, and by my own hand, no less. However, you've a trial to undertake. I do? If you wish to prove yourself and become a Watcher of the Veil, that is. I presume you are prepared. Yeah. I will also require your assistance in carrying out the trial. Much danger awaits within, and I wish to ensure his safety. When you're ready, simply say the word. Absolutely. You think I'd leave Red Where hanging? We go. After everything we've been through? Absolutely not. We got your back, Red. I wonder if this area is going to put Red as a frontliner. That'd be interesting. Now we follow the cave where it leads, deep as it will take us. Oh. No. <laughs> who's, who's doing that? Oh. told you anything about his parents yet? No. Nope. They were watchers, both of them, but they couldn't have been any more different. When our village came under attack, my mother fought with courage, with honor. She faced the enemy and laid down her life to save us. My father, though, he turned tail and ran. He was a coward. So then, you still haven't forgiven him? Why would I? I see. Chamber of Deception, what a name. <laughs> From this point onward, only two may proceed. He who shall undertake the trial and his observer. So is it me Who's and... Who's gonna observe? I'll do it. Okay. Cloud and red, let's go. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> that would render the trial meaningless. Hmm. Is it Aerith? But if not him... Barret. <laughs> ah, you do nicely. Me? Him? Really? <laughs> At least pretend not to hate me. <laughs> Oh, whenever you're ready. Ready. Hmm. All right. And we are controlling him. Oh, it's so good. Even a specialty little shop here for him. Okay, so... A road warrior bangle? Hmm. We own four of them? It's better than what Aerith's got on for some reason. Okay. Supernatural wrist guards? All right, first off, Barrett, I want you to have a revive. You've got some cure magic. We need an assess. Uh, 
Um, we don't need auto cast, so maybe what I'll do is switch for the all. Or... What's the one that... Who has the one that costs less uh, MP? Magic efficiency. Let's do magic efficiency there. And we'll call that good for now. Definitely going to try out some assesses and stuff here. Um, let's see. Red, you are working on Watcher's Respite. Come on, get it. There you go. <laughs> Bespoke animation, I love it. I love it. The small details are so good. Make sure that you are well prepared. Make sure that you are well prepared. You gonna watch my back? Yep. Burning holes in you right now. Okay, Bugenhagen is coming with us. Have they been pronouncing it Bugenhagen or Hagen? What is this? This is a place of deep sorrow. A place where those who have been sealed away are left to mourn their fate. We got this covered. You just float yourself up into a nook. <laughs> if I were going to already. Do it in! Okay, is your ability it what is the deplete the vengeance gauge to heal allies? So we have to take damage before that'll be accessible. Okay. Now on. Well how's this? Here goes! Gotcha! Yeah. Look here. Huh. Such walls should be well within your power to climb. Cool. Approach glowing surfaces and use L to scamper along walls. Stop moving or press circle to drop, but remember to watch where you land. That's cool. Okay. Check our kerners. Nice, bro. Oh, that's gonna... That'll make you dizzy. <laughs> ah! We're just gonna not wonder what Barrett's doing to get around. Oh, he just climbs over. <laughs> mm. This place has given me the creeps. Your discomfort is only natural. A fierce battle was waged here. And even after 45 years, the scars remain fresh. What? You're saying the Gi managed to make it all the way up here? <laughs> okay, somebody fill me in. Ooh. Or the Gi. A tribe known to very few people outside of the base. The rest you will learn in due time. In fact, you can be certain. Now, let us proceed. Okay, weak to fire and Zeo. Or, <laughs> Fire and lightning. Exploiting their elemental weakness will pressure them. Not good enough. <laughs> Sorry. Get all you got. Count me 
out yet. Hey, gotcha. Oops. Damn it. What the? Coming at ya. Let's end this. His work is never done. The watcher's work is never done. Hey, where'd you run off to? Yeah. I only got two legs here, you know. Okay, let's check up there. Every time I let go of the guard button. Every damn time. I got it. Now, did I do good or did I do good? You did good. Damn, if that doesn't look convenient. Okay. Is that actually... Oh! Oh! Nice! Oh, <laughs> I thought it was gonna kill that thing too. That would've been cool. I only got two legs here, you know. Don't worry, I'm coming back, bro. Don't worry about it. Okay, I think... Any, yep, there's a pathway over there. Let's go and check that out real quick, and then I think we've explored all of this stuff. Bam! Hey, where'd you run off to? All right, let's go. Okay, I don't think I actually assess these guys. Watch my back. Gotcha. Nailed it. Done. End of the line. Sorry. Suck on this. Still here. And don't come back. Damn, if that doesn't look convenient. Okay. 
Big ol' room here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. It'll be easy to miss shit here. Only got two legs here, you know. I know, Barrett. <laughs> I think you mentioned. <laughs> okay, let's go get that chest. Make sure we don't hit the edge or we're gonna jump off. Damn if that doesn't look convenient. I love how he's just using his kid voice now. Hey, Bugenhagen, you're messing up my boxes. There are items in those, bro. How dare you? All right, let's just do a quick check, make sure there's nothing that we missed up here. I think we're good. Okay. Get one tier at a time, double check our kerners. That's where we came from, got the chest, okay. Hey, where'd you run off to? Thank you, Barrett. Okay, so you mastered the respite, right? Okay, and Barrett's got his stuff mastered, so we're good there. Um, did we like this as our weapon, though? That's the other thing we need to check. Big attack? Yeah, let, let's stick with big attack. 106 on your attack, bro? That's awesome. Looks like a fight. Here we go. What the hell is that? That is a key. It's huge. <laughs> Under normal circumstances, I would stress that you mustn't judge a book by its cover. But for the Gi, however, they are as fearsome as their appearance implies. These are the things that killed my mom? Nanaki, this shall be your first trial. You are to explore this place. Understand the nature of its history. Okay, will do. Press and hold L2 near an object to grab it with your mouth and release the button to drop it. Initiating combat will also cause you to automatically drop a held item. Grab the Gi artifacts scattered around the cavern and ask Bugenhagen to inspect them. Okay. We can do that. Look at those things. There we go. Oh, 
memories of war. The hour of our awakening draws nigh. Most would call that materia, but it is far more than a magic stone. It is a crystallized collection of the planet's memories and knowledge. Oh, three-star healing materia? Cool. Spear? Well, if it isn't a key arrow, arrow, its point is coated with a poison that rapidly circulates through the body, slowing the wounded until they are completely turned to stone. We saw a bunch of those arrows on our way into this place. Just a bone. <laughs> <laughs> that is but a mere bone. Trying to tell me this is a cat. <laughs> Nay, that Stone? Is not the relic we seek. Oh. Oh, oh. oh sorry. I haven't slept well of late. <laughs> you okay, old man? Crimsonite crystal. Cool. Nay, that is not the relic we seek. I don't know what that is. This is. I'm not sure. But I'm pleased to see that you're enjoying yourself. Just tell me I'm a good boy. Okay, so weakness is fire. Spirits of the Gi that perished during the invasion of Cosmo Canyon now cursed to haunt its caverns. They were sealed underground, lest they unleash their deep-seated hatred upon innocents. Exploiting their elemental weakness with magic attacks or hitting them with healing spells will pressure them. They spin their spears to deflect all ranged physical attacks. Oh. Hitting them with strong close range physical attacks while they are doing this will pressure them. Uh, they will not remain dead so long as a G Gi sorcerer is present. Okay, interesting. you fought was a fallen key. No, <laughs> he just floats up into the Even air. Even in death, their lingering enmity manifests as such. They who wander in search of retribution. That's kind of pathetic. Do not be so quick to denigrate your enemies, nor make light of their plight. Consider this statue. It has been placed in this chamber for a reason. Handle it with the utmost care. I will. Deliver unto us the remnants of our past. 
Gather statues to proceed. First trial is done. Uh, how are we doing on health? We could do a little bit of a top off. Does it show which one of these are coming from, um, whatchamacallit, the enemy skill materia? I think Sonic Boom, Plasma Discharge, Soothing Breeze, oh yeah, and Self Destruct, okay. So Sonic Boom, Wind Magic, Grants Bravery and Faith. I should be using this shit more. Guess it's my turn! End of the line. Oh, we're done here. Oh man, look at this place. Okay, that looks like a goal. <laughs> If we don't find a new weapon for him at the end of this, I will cry. We will. I think I know exactly where we're going to find it, too. Yeah, this place is cool. Are these altars? Okay, four statues. So two more trials. Cause my first thought was, are we gonna make it out of this place alive? <laughs> its decor is indeed the opposite of inviting. These look like the statue I picked up. If there is a reason for everything, then one could argue that everything has no reason. Regardless, you know what you must do, don't you? Deliver unto us the remnants of our past. Restore them to their rightful place. Two more trials. Oh, there's one right there. <laughs> well, that one's easy. this lead we got okay this doesn't lead anywhere so
I'm guessing this is in case we fail, right? This is our way back up. Orb of Fortification. Yeah, so this would have been if we fell. Look at that swim animation. Is that thing gonna wake up? Maybe when we get the last statue. Oh, yeah, here we go. Ooh. Is this a different type? No, still Lancer. The yes. Oh, Bear's not with us. Okay, let's do Sonic Boom because that gives us bravery and faith. I got all turned around. There we go. For a second, I thought there was a third direction we could have gone. All right, we're going to put this on the platform, and then I think that uh, we're going to have to end this episode. So we won't get to see uh, the end of the trial until the next one. The Emerald Altar. Ooh, are these all named after the weapons? Our sadness sinks beneath stone. The history of the Vale is intertwined with the Gi, for they first came to these lands many millennia ago. This sanctuary is proof of their persistence, for it was built to ensure that they never escaped. But if they were sealed away thousands of years ago, how'd they break out and attack the Vale? That I cannot answer. Only the key themselves could. But enough about them. You are here to learn about yourself, Nanaki. All right, Nanaki, you will be learning more about yourself in the next episode. So thank you all for being here. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next episode. Have a good one, everybody. Bye. I'd like to give a very special shout out to my patron supporters, Darren York, ZTD, Knife Namase, Kyle the Monarch, Chris Murphy, JW, Quinless, Vlado101, Andy Ford, Bruce Wizzle, Black Mamba90, Eureka Gecko, A Happy Fat Panda, Pedo Kuto, Shadow Raven, Anna Kate the Great, Emily Kuzanoa, Philip Dowdy, Timothy Jansen, Skip, Daniel, St. Germain Soleil, Yell, and Nadia N. If you would also like to join this tier or any others, check out my memberships or my Patreon in the description down below.